So, what are the point mutations? Point mutations uh, are when in the long chain uh, of the nucleotides we have some single change. What are the possible changes? We have simple deletions. So, when we have deletion, uh, we get out some nucleotides. When we also can get, let's get back to the situation that we. Ah, oh, sorry. So, we can also add some additional nucleotide. This is called insertion. So, when we add some additional nucleotide, it's insertion. We also, let's get back to the original, we also can exchange the nucleotide. So, we cut out some and we put some other. Yeah, it can be anything, like thymine, for example. So, generally, when we have change from the purine to the pyrimidine, or from the pyrimidine to the purine, we call it transversion. Yes. Uh, when we have the same group, so the pyrimidine to pyrimidine, or purine to the purine, we have the transduction. Uh, sorry, transition. Uh, simple like that. So, this is, these are generally the substitutions. Okay, so uh, we also, I was also asking about the codons and anticodons. About codons, I already talked in the previous video, but let's get it one more time. So uh, we have different codons. Codons are always the triplets of the nucleotides. So we have three nucleotides in each codon. And each codon is saving the information about amino acids or something else. For example, AUG is a typical uh, codon for the um, for the methionine. So methionine uh, is encoded by the AUG. How it is possible that the methionine is uh, encoded in AUG? We also have the anticodon. Yes. How does this anticodon look like? Obviously, the anticodon needs to fit the codon. So, uh, I'll make it because it's not visible that it's a G. So, what fits to the, fits to the G? Yeah. Guanine always pairs with cytosine. Uracil always pairs with thymine. And, uh, sorry, sorry, with adenine. And adenine always pairs with uracil. Yes. So this tells us how the anticodon would look like. The anticodon is on the tRNA. Yes. So the tRNA keeps the anticodons that is created to fit the codon. And on the other end of the tRNA, there is amino acid. You have seen this in the animation uh, that I published previously. This is function of the codons and anticodons. This is a key idea. Of course, some codons are also uh, keeping other informations, like there is a very specific codon, stop codon, that just tells uh, the ribosome to stop uh, creating the protein. That is end of the protein. And no further protein creation would be produced. Okay, thank you very much.